Sumit Pokhril, the founder of Music Art Society, had been working as a music teacher at private schools in Kathmandu for more than two decades. Since the year 2009, he started giving free music lessons to children living in two different orphanages in Kathmandu, but it was after two years that the establishment of Music Art Society was conceptualized. One day, during a morning stroll with his daughter, Sumit saw a boy strumming his guitar under a tree, and it was then he realized the need to broaden his horizon and start teaching music to underprivileged children. He then started the process of registering a non-profit organization dedicated to providing free music education to orphans, children belonging to low-income families living in slums and with special needs. In the year 2013, Music Art Society had officially registered as non-profit organization and rented two rooms where it started giving music lessons to about 40 children. Out of these, 11 were benefited with free music education. Since its establishment, Music Art Society has touched the lives of many children through music education. It has been offering free lessons in vocal, violin, keyboard, guitar and music theory. To collect funds for its cause, Music Art Society has established Maria Duo School of Music at Kappan in Kathmandu in 2015. The school offers music education at minimal costs to children of all background committed to making music education accessible to every child. Music Art Society initiated a project entitled Music for the Nation. Under this project, it has been giving free music education to more than 300 children studying in various public and community schools situated in mountain region of Kathmandu. Please come on. Over a hundred students come to Music Art Society to take music lessons, out of which six students travel approximately 17 kilometers on foot to and from Danagao village. Music Art Society has acquired a land in Buranilkanta, a mountain region in Kathmandu, where it aims to establish its school. The calm and peaceful environment aids in effective learning and improving concentration of the students and also eases the trouble of the students who now have to travel far to take music lessons. Given the lack of proper college for music education in the country, Music Art Society aspires to grow its school into a college and gradually to a university where the students in Nepal could gain quality music education, enabling them to compete with students and professionals in music from around the world. So far, the organization has had 10 major musical shows where students have focused their talents to a wider audience and continues to organize regular talent shows and jamming sessions to increase the confidence and performance skills of the students. The organization strives to develop its teachers in professional development and has recently conducted various workshops in collaboration with professional music educators from Japan, Australia and America. Dr. Jennifer McDonnell has supported Music Art Society since 2013 by raising funds to send books, 
props and instruments to Nepal for facilitating music education. Travelling to Nepal in 2016-2017 and 2019 to present music education workshops for teachers and children in Kathmandu, Japa and Pokhara, she has also been performing research about music education in Nepal and impact of workshops on music teachers' efficiency and student learning. So sometimes when they need to just calm down, I would sing them a lullaby like that. It helps them to just calm themselves down and get recentered. Dr. McDonnell is deeply committed to the success of Music Art Society and has committed financial assistance to our construction of a permanent building for Music Art Society in Kathmandu. Music Art Society would like to extend its gratitude to the students teachers, artists, individuals, and organizations for their care and support in enriching the lives of children through music. The organization salutes the enthusiasm and commitment of the children who have not let their financial and physical limitations become a hindrance between them and their dreams. <laughs>